Okay, good everyone. Welcome back to Was It Half Triple Eight. Um, in this episode, I think it's episode six uh, of the 1978 utility rebuild. Uh, the aim is to uh, get a second coat of paint on the deck. Um, what else we had in mind? Uh, get all the wheels assembled um, and possibly get everything put back onto the onto the deck. Just depends on on drying time and so forth. Um, had to work this morning, so that sort of bugging at me plans a little bit, but that's life. Uh, and the weather's a bit ordinary too. It's pretty cold, so <laughs> excuse me. Um, so we'll see how it pans out. But that's that's the aim. Um, get a second coat of paint on the deck. Uh, get all the wheels and everything mounted back on, possibly get the chassis uh, and the rails and connecting rods all pulled back on, but uh, anyway, stick around, uh, have a look see, and uh, we'll see where we go. Thanks. Uh, righto, so um, I just hit the record button and my father called, so um, it's good, it's fine out of chat, no problem at all. So uh, what we're doing tonight is um, cleaning up these little fellas. Uh, a bit, bit dirty, but um, we got uh, some gloves, got some gumption, we all need a bit of gumption, some water, a couple of uh, old toothbrushes, and most importantly, a cup of coffee. So, wish me luck. I'm actually loving these, these things fit like a glove. Righto. Let's have a look at what we got. Might try the um, hubcaps first. Dip them in some water. Bit of gumption on. I don't know if this is going to work. I've never used gumption before. Haven't seen anyone use gumption. Gumption. But I would like to think that it will work. Can't see why not. Finished doing these hubcaps and I'll show the finished product. Back soon. Alright, um, yeah, look, that one's bloody mint. Mint condition. That one's not too bad. That one's a little bit crashed up obviously on the left hand side uh, and that one's been attacked by something uh, it actually goes all the way through there and there's a dent there and there's chunks off uh, look, I, don't know. I may see if I can fix that up I may just leave it because that's what was on the mower I may see if I can find a whole new set I don't know but as it is they come up pretty good. Um, um, all right, we're going to tackle these little beauties at the moment. Um, this is the worst of the lot. It's got a hole there. Another one over this side. As you can see, the light shining through. Um, so I don't know what to expect, but we'll give them the same treatment as what we did with the hubcaps. We'll give them a bit of a gumptioning up and. Um, see what we end up with. Uh, once again, I'd, I don't know whether I want to get new wheels, these are what we're on it. If they tidy up, they're going back on. I don't know if you can see that or not. The grey rim, not so grey. So I think they're going to come up again. Okay. Yeah. I think they're going to come up okay. So, uh, yeah. All right, come back. I'll turn this off. We'll give this one a clean thoroughly, both sides. And uh, I'll film it and see, um, show you what we've got at the end result. Uh, righto. Um, obviously, this was the worst wheel out of the lot of dirt. Um, but that's come up pretty good inside there. Grey rims and on the back, um, it's pretty cruddy. So, 
uh, steel wool would be good, but I don't have any. Um, I might use a maybe try a little bit of sandpaper on that and see how that comes up. But um, yeah, maybe a bit later. I just want to get the most of this stuff off. Yummy. Um, and see how it all looks when it's all done. Um, but cool, that's good. Three down. I mean, one down, three to go. Uh, wheels are done, that's pretty impressive. Um, you probably can't see that because the lighting, I'm sitting where this, a bit more light on the subject. Um, yeah, yum. Let's put that out of the way. Um, that's better. Yeah, so the wheels come up not too bad. Cap on. Very nice. Um, which is the best one? That one there. With that one there. Look at that. Like a bought one. And we've got hail. I may have to stop filming because we've got hail, and I don't know if you can hear me or not. But we'll keep we'll keep going for now. There's a little C clip, I don't know why that's off. Can't remember, but it'll come back to me as we're going through. So we've got four of these, one, two, three, four. Hold the wheels on, one, two, to hold the connecting rod on. These go into the deck, and the axles go through that with one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four bolts. Uh, and these are a series of bushes. I'll hold it down, I don't know what that's for. Um, but we shall find out. Can you still hear me? I think the hail might have stopped. As I said in the last episode, the reason I don't get out here very often is because it's bloody cold out here. Um, we're in the middle of winter and we've got weather warnings galore at the moment. So, apart from the bushes, Nuts and bolts, even with the nylon washers. These fellas. Etc. Clips. Look at that. Isn't that yummy? So I do miss Pat. Gremlins in my garage. Alright, so I'll let that sit there and soak. Alright, uh, Oakley Doakley. Um, plan is for the moment is to uh, a few things. Uh, put some paint, clean these up and put some paint on them. Um, possibly silver I'm reckoning uh, it looks like they should be silver they wouldn't have had any paint on them before I don't think but uh, they will be silver now um, get the wheels painted up onto the uh, chassis stuff um, that's obviously a security camera um, tidy that up and uh, the main aim is to uh, do a bit of sanding on the deck so um, Stick around and that's what we'll get settled up. Let me clean this stuff up, uh, make a bit of space on here, and uh, we'll get the deck out. Uh, that's deck, we'll get the deck out. Um, give it a sand over with a bit of uh, 600. Um, and I'm thinking we might give it another coat of paint, so I'll uh, rig up some sheets and so forth and we'll stick a coat of paint on it. So stick around and uh, we'll see how we go. Alright, um, look, I'm not going to sand a lot of this off, I'm just going to take the sheen off so I can get some more paint on there. Um, this has been nearly a week now, it's been sitting, and that's uh, come up pretty good. All those scratches that I was worried about are pretty much gone. Um, so uh, let's get into it. It's just a bit of worn stuff, 600 that I've used before uh, to do the undercoat. 
So let's see, it's just going to be white sand just to scuff it up. And um, give me something to paint to, or something to, for the paint to stick to. sanding this back is because there's bits here from the first coat which have um, didn't cover too well uh, and that's when I sanded off the spray putty these bits were exposed so that's all right that's why we give it a second coat it's all good probably see that the shine's going off this a bit. Not too much as I said I only 600 grit so I didn't want to sand the paint off I just wanted to get the shine off so that'll come up nice. So we'll put some uh, bit of a drop sheet up there so I don't get paint everywhere and we'll give it a bit of a spray. Alright I think that'll do it. Um, more of the same. Fiddly bits, gloss bright orange. Sexy. And that, my friends, is two coats of orange. Okay, honky dory. Um, next plan of attack is to clean those little fellas up. And that, which I'm sure is a off the exhaust, off the muffler. Um, so we get the old wire brush out. Pair of pliers, and away we go. Oh no! A little bit of silver on the bolts. Yes, yeah, so these bits are going to be black. So that's that. Now I'll set this up on something. I'll set it up on something and um, we'll black away. Probably said before with the black we are using is satin black. And off we go. And once again doesn't have to be perfect. And that be it. All, right, all I have to do now is just wait for everything to dry. I would like, I would like um, to get some of this put back together. If I can today, um, with the wheels and everything on the chassis, that would be an achievement and a half for me. Alright, I might go and watch a bit of footy, can the eagles, um, while this is all drying, we'll come back in about an hour's time and see how we go. Stick around. Ah, uh, okay. um, what I did want to do was be able to put everything back on this as far as the actual assembly and so forth, but um, 
Yeah, I think it might still be a little bit soft. So we're not going to do that. What we may do is put the wheels on. And these fellas. Well there you go, um, didn't quite get everything achieved, uh, as I said the weather's pretty cold and it's uh, been fairly wet so uh, the paint didn't get to dry properly on the on the deck but it does look pretty smick now, um, I'll take some still shots and I'll put up at the end um, of how it all looks, uh, probably see behind me, uh, didn't get everything mounted up for that reason so, um, but at least all the, all the hardware's all cleaned up and painted um, and we did get the second coat on, on the deck. Uh, the wheels are on, the axles or stubs. Uh, so yeah, look, it's, it's coming along slowly. Um, not as quickly as I'd like, but same old story, time, time and time. So anyway, um, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment and let me know what you think of this uh, uh, ongoing saga of the uh, 1978 utility rebuild so uh, thanks again and um, we'll catch you next time it was a half to a late bye for now mm -hmm.